What's the best way to apply a silane siloxane sealer? So silane siloxane sealers are generally single component. There's no mixing ratio involved. They come in one container. So they just need a little bit of stirring and then they can be easily applied. We recommend using a pump up sprayer, something that you can use to flood the area, allow that penetrating sealer, silane siloxane sealer to soak into the concrete surface. The uh, application rate will depend on how porous, how long it takes for the sealer to soak in. If it's very slow to soak in, likely you're only going to need one coat. And all that sealer should have soaked in within about 15, 20 minutes. If it's still on the surface after that time, then you need to sweep that or brush that off or roll it off into an area that hasn't been sealed. That's why we say work in small areas, flood coat it, uh, make sure it's soaked in after about 10 minutes, then move on to another area. If the whole area has already been sealed and you feel it needs another coat, and uh, again, the same thing, make sure it soaks in after 10 minutes. If it's not soaking in, then that needs to be cleaned up, uh, picked up uh, using a cloth or uh, some absorbent uh, material just to get that off the surface. So you wipe it up, uh, sponge it up, uh, mop it up. Uh, don't allow that excess penetrating sealer to sit on the surface and dry. You'll have streaking. Uh, it'll be uh, very, uh, it'll be ugly to look at. It'll wear off eventually, but it's just very unsightly. So it's better to clean that off at the time of application.